Hello Gold Farmers, welcome to another Gold Nuts Farming video. And today we'll be taking a look at one of my aquarium ore routes. I actually just created this one, so I'm not too certain on how much this will actually yield, but it shouldn't take any more than 15 minutes to actually complete a full lap, which really isn't that bad at all. I've already gotten two aquarium nodes off of this route, and I had actually created a smaller version similar to this one that was actually used for herbalism and mining, but because I am not an herbalist right now, I can't really share that one with you guys. So I went ahead and edited it a little bit to make it so it's a pure mining route, and it seems to do fairly well for the most part. I've gotten quite a bit of adamantite ore and actually felt iron ore. Uh, the felt iron ore I am actually pretty impressed about just because of how hard it is to actually farm inside of Hellfire Peninsula. You don't typically see that a whole lot, but if you can't sell the adamantite ore on your server, then what I would recommend that you do is use the adamantite ore shuffle. I did cover a video over it a while ago. I will leave it in the description below. But basically you just need a jewel crafter and you just prospect all of the adamantite ore. And you need to hope that you get the golden dray or dray knight or whatever that is. For felt iron ore, I haven't gone over a shuffle for that one yet, but you can turn it into the fell steel, I believe is what it is called, which for my server it sells for quite a bit, and I am I actually make quite a bit of gold off of that one. As far as the adamantite ore shuffle, it usually just depends on how much I price the gem for. Sometimes I can get somebody to buy it out at around 150 gold right away, and sometimes it is a little bit harder for me, but I do make a decent amount of gold off of that one as well. I have recently seen quite a few videos, and I've just, I guess, heard quite a bit about Quarium Ore recently. So I've decided that I want to go ahead and share my routes with you guys. That way you can hopefully gather the amount that you need. I've already shared a few of them. Just not all of them yet. I need to go through and see if I can't find any footage or maybe screenshots of my old routes. That way I can actually share the good ones with you guys. I used to be able to get around 15 to 40 of the aquarium or every hour for each of the routes that I had created. This one so far it's not bad. I've gotten two nodes which is pretty decent. I've not I just edited the route so I actually don't know where all of the aquarium or spawns. I haven't collected any of the ore here yet, so chances of there being quarium are a little bit less likely. I have gathered the ore up around this side of the route as well. I am hoping to make my routes somewhat like Toro uh, and how he did it and all of that at least the videos so hopefully that will all work out for each lap I make I can make around 1k which really isn't bad for one lap that's about 5k every hour and that's with turning all of the modes into primals and factoring in all of the quarium ore that I might be able to get and just a bunch of different random stuff I do believe that will be all for this guide. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe for more content.